Okay, let's go to the friendly isle, Maui, uh, excuse me, uh, Molokai. This is West Molokai. Uh, so pretty much from the airport west. Projected wind speeds. All right, for looking at West uh, Molokai, 40 to 50 mile an hour winds with gust to 70. And again, those are impressive wind speeds, especially when they're just under hurricane strength. And for the rainfall, similar forecast to Lena'i, additional around one inch. All right, let's go to East Molokai. This is from an area that encompasses the airport down through Kauna Kakai mm -hmm. and all the way through the Halava Valley. All right, wind speeds for East Molokai. 40 to 50 miles an hour for this area with gusts to 70. And then we're looking at additional 4 to 8 inches. That's a lot of rain. Uh, with locally higher amounts. So, again, a lot more coming through for the eastern portion of Molokai. And the reason is, and the reason why we've actually seen these numbers go up since even what we were talking about earlier this morning, is that that track did bump up a little bit to the north. So, as of right now, the Central Pacific Hurricane Center's graphic is a little bit, it is a little bit more to the north and more of a hit on the island of Molokai. All right, and I just want to make mention Molokai, especially when you uh, head towards Halava Valley from Kauna Kakai, there's only one road there. So if there are mm -hmm. any potential down power poles or if there's any flooding issues, sections, the entire east side section, depending on where the issues are, could get cut off. Right. Uh, so this is an area where I hope people have taken preparations mm -hmm. to make sure they have provisions to make it last for a couple of days. There's only one road um, in and out through Waialua. So. Yeah, and speaking of roads and flooding, again, you guys, never drive or walk across fast-moving water or just moving water in general. Uh, you're really going to want to, if you can, just stay home tomorrow, stay off the roads, because, again, we are expecting a lot of this widespread rainfall to be impacting much of the state. And with these flash flooding conditions possible, it could get pretty messy out there. Yeah, exactly.